1117. Oh, some of you guys just met a new soulmate or spirit is getting people together. This can be Archangel Raphael. Okay. Um, he is also the angel on the lover's card. That's what he is in um, pursuit when it comes to, you know, getting in the contracts with the lovers. All right. So this person's in your contract. Oh, shit, Nick. Oh, we got to see what is going on, soulmates. Get up in here. Let's get your weekly forecast. Whatever's happening here can be happening physically, spiritually, um, this week between you and your person. Okay, it can, this is energy that can come towards you this week or actually happen this week. All right, don't you worry about a thing. I'll be reading all the signs and energies that I see here for you guys. If you don't know already, I am your shaman empress, a.k.a. the shaman hummingbird. All right, so let's see what's going on. On. Make sure that you're subscribed to your areas only placements left tarot anywhere areas is in you your person's chart any karmic energies attachments Those messages are over there for you guys cafe astrology is linked down below to help you out with any placement issues Ooh, We got the ten of wands and the page of swords. So you're about to meet somebody online um, some of you guys could, I just heard dating apps. Yeah, you could be like on a dating app or something like that. I, I feel like some of you guys was already had walked away out of a situation and maybe you weren't expecting to get into something. There could have been some still burdens that you are putting up with, um, dealing with, healing from, purging, cleansing. But you got somebody that's watching you. Somebody has been watching you on a healing journey. This could be somebody that also watched you involved. Okay. Um, yep, two of swords. And I feel like um, you don't see... Your head is not even in that space right now. Or this person is already aware of all of that. You, ain't, you have blocked off. And some of you guys ain't really like... You're not looking for it. That energy could... You could have blocked that off. Your focus is on a journey somewhere else. But this person is watching though. Yeah, it is. The page of ones. All right. Um, let's see what else is coming out. Wait a minute. Yep, the queen of swords. So, this person is watching you be the queen of swords. You've just been chilling. You've been to yourself. But it's catching the eye of somebody. Your quietness is. Um, and you could feel like right now maybe relationships are burnt. And that's why the angelics are trying to help you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep, the six of pentacles, old child, and the hangman. This person is stuck on you. You have this person's attention and trying to figure out what's it going to take or some shit. What can they give you? Um, also, is there somebody else? This could be also somebody that wants to give you something to spend time, but they're aware of. It's like, well, who's this other person that put you in this energy? Um, who's this other person that got you, like, blocked off? Who put you in a bind? Who is behind you now? Virgo energy. Okay, it's behind you now. Something here definitely could have changed um, for some of you guys. Uh, this in your appearance, whether it's a stress, weight, this can even be hair. Because sometimes the hair uh, um, um, goes, like, in and out. Um, strong Libra energy is also something I'm getting a scorpion. What else is popping up for the collective? Yep, here it is. Oh, I can't make it up. The lover's card. Damn, I'm good. That's what she said. See the angel? Yeah, Archangel Raphael. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So he's so Archangel Raphael is basically telling you to get on your feet, get on a journey, because you're about to meet somebody, and that's just what it's going to be. Yeah, but you're blocked off to the Two of Cups. I can't make this up. you just been working. But that's all about the blow up. Look at the angelics. Yup. Because you don't see this coming that you're about to heal. This is a relationship. And somebody here, has, they're watching you online or something. Or you're a pistol. They watch what you post. Look at this King of Swords. Both of you guys have been through something. I feel like what you have just begun to heal from, this King of Swords could have already all the way healed from. With another situation or something. Yep, we got the Empress and the Four of Cups. Now, this person does got a baby's mom or a baby's daddy. They don't like, I repeat. That's what she said. They do got a baby's daddy or a baby's mama. They don't like. 
So both of you guys got exes in the past that you don't deal with. And these are situations that you could have had to learn lessons from. And it looks like y'all both did that. And that's why you're getting this relationship. The lovers in the hangman. That's why you're getting this relationship, but you don't see it. Y'all, Neither one of y'all see this coming. Y'all don't see this at all. It's right in front of you. This soulmate is right in front. Of, this is somebody you're already like... There's, with the aces, you're not about to meet this person. This person is in your energy. Yeah, the seven of ones and the two of cups. They're already in your energy. So you have already seen them, met them. I'm also seeing Tesaurus, Aries, Geminin. Yeah. So we have one, eight, two, six. I'm also seeing 8267. All right, let me uh, meditate and see which angelic number we're going to rock with together. You can look both of them up and then we'll do some clarifications for you. Okay, angel number 8267 is associated with spiritual awakening and alignment. So when it comes to careers, it can indicate that you are on the right path. See, whatever you've been through, you had to go through it. Um, cause it puts you on the right path and it also did the same thing for them. Now this person watches, they look for certain things and they see it in you. That's why you're pulling the queen of swords and they're pulling the king of swords. Yep. This is a, a, a star sword, to, the star card to the king of swords. But you guys could be star seeds, soulmates, but this is somebody that had to heal too. Yeah, they went through their shit and what you don't know. That's what you could learn and find out that they had changes. They don't look the same either. You know, um, whatever happened here, whether this is weight, you know, some of you guys, you could have had longer hair. Maybe you, you went through some kind of transformation. You cut your hair um, now or something like that. Also, you could have, you know, stress, went through certain things, will do certain things to you, okay, um, here, but you healed from it. So it might no longer be like affecting you right now. But this is also somebody that's wondering with the Six of Pentacles, the Hangman, and the Lover's Card. Are you still holding on? That's what they're looking for. This could be why they didn't say anything yet. Are you still holding on to the past? Or is that person in the past, like, do you, you know, making sure, like, you're over whatever. And this is, like, also what I'm getting. This is also somebody that is, like... They can tell, like, you know, you've been hurt. And they just want to make sure you're healed from that. Oh, child, what's the Six of Pentacles? This person is, is going back and forth. Now, somebody here wants to, like, give you some money. Or do something for you. Or make some kind of offer to you. Or something like that. But they're, they're not sure if they should do it yet. Yep, they want to take this leap of faith to Joker Court. But see, they're not they're not sure if they should do it yet. Because they're not sure. Yeah, Six of Swords. They want to come towards you and they feel it in their spirit. But they just want to make sure there's like no ex still lingering on. Because they can tell you've been hurt by an ex. It's like somebody here feels like they recognize it. Because they see their selves in you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's a source energy. What's the six of, uh, six of Pentacles? Somebody here is also like, yeah, I remember when that happened to me, I was just like that. When I did this, I was just like that. That's another reason why they, because you, you're like, y'all are like of the same frequency of vibration, the king and the queen of swords. So it's almost like y'all soulmates. The same way they were at react, you, you reacted. It's like, they don't want to, like they know, they know. They experienced it. They experienced the pain. They said term oil, so it was term oil. Some of you guys, your kids be playing in a walkway. Also, some of you guys got like, uh, could have like a tree house, but not so much a tree house. Like maybe they're like hanging stuff on the tree, ropes, toys. Some of you guys could have like a trail in your yard or something. You could walk the trail by the river or a trail where there's water. This could even be a lake or something like that. The um, Like parks have like water in it or something. Okay. 
Yeah. All right, show me the Six of Pentacles. Yep, the Eight of Swords, I told you. They're trying to make sure you ain't stuck and they ain't got to kick nobody's ass about you or you're going to have them in some shit because you're not really over somebody. The Two of Wands, yep, so that's why they haven't made a quite decision yet, but they got a plan. Yep, here it is, the Four of Wands for a relationship. Now, the thing is, they're scared. This person don't want to be hurt anymore, now the ones. They don't. So they're a little defensive. And, it, and it's like, somebody here could also say, and I got to say this, you know, why would you go back to that person? You know, you ain't ever going back to that. Look how they hurt. They just, they want to make sure you're, like, ready. Yup. What's the seven of ones? What's the seven of ones? They know you're, like, real standoffish. You're, like, real closed off or something like they can this person can read you and there's certain key things they look for and they they can they can put together this is also somebody that can see energy whether they know that or not they can see it they see things on people yep and you guys are cut from the same cloth soulmates seven of wands uh, the king, of, yep, they want to make an offer. They know your world stand off, but they want to make an offer to you and they're hoping you're going to receive it. And yeah, four swords and that you like them. That's what they've been thinking about. Yep, they're going to file. So oh, this person got a plan. And if they first plan don't work, they got a second plan or some shit like that. Um, what's the ten of ones? Yeah. And this is also somebody, somebody here is very smart. Yeah. So it's like they make money from their ideas. And whatever kind of work that is, that's what pays them. This could be online. Like they can maybe they're in partnership or some shit where they give ideas to like their companies or something. You ever meet them people that go around and they give ideas to new inventions or some shit like that? It don't have to be on that level, but you know, I'm just saying. And it, it gives they get paid for that. Almost like um Anybody watch uh, Acrimony by Ta Tyler Perry? Remember Ta Ta uh, Taraji P's um, husband on there? He was like working on that battery. It was like a billion dollar idea, but they tried to like, you know, like chump change him at first and he had to like stand on business and then he like got a big ass offer. Somebody here like does that on some kind of level. They could just be seeing for like, uh, like, uh, um, abundance from it though. Like, um, when they made the first offer to her husband, it wasn't, it was basically like for nothing. He would be like a fool to take it, but it sounds good. He's like, they could be in that area of business, but really whatever they got, it's a, like a billion dollar idea. They just have to put their muscle. They got stand on business or some shit. So you guys might be able to grow money together or something. What's the ten of wands? What's the ten of wands? Mm. The Joker card. They want to take a chance, but you're yeah, they're real defensive. Yeah, Queen of Cups and the Four of Pentacles. Cause someone here really wants true love. Yeah, they really want true love. Um, you guys are matching. Okay, they really, 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 really want uh true love with the King and the Queen of Cups. And this is someone here. It's like that's what they're looking for at this point in their life. And if that's not what it is, then they're gonna keep it moving or some shit like that. The Queen of Wands energy, or they'll try to tell you to keep it moving. <laughs> What's the Eight of Cups? Oh, hold on. Yup, the Seven of Cups and the Queen of Wands. Yeah. Yup. Other options. I can't make it up. Yeah. All right. But they already know you have walked away from a, like a situation, but are you done with a situation? Or are you done with somebody? I just saw the three of pentacles. This person is working together on like, they're starting, I don't know if this is like part, you know, that was part of his dream. Whatever this money goal is, whatever this abundance is, yeah. This person has been disappointed. This person here could have got backstabbed from a lover. That's kind of what acrimony is all about somebody that was supposed to stand by them maybe they never thought this it was going to work out for them but it is they're going to they're going to get um it might not have worked out the way they want it might even took a little longer but they're definitely going to manifest something they put in the universe here 
Damn. Um, we got the Five of Cups. Yep. See, somebody here was extremely disappointed. Even could have went through depression with the Five of Cups, but they're going to come out victor, uh, victorious. Yep, justice. This is like universal. Yeah. Because they're, whatever they're putting together, their own magic. And see, they went through hell and really had to fight hard with the Five of One. Yup, look at this in the Page of Cups. Yeah, they really, really had to fight hard through something. And they juggled for a while. Look at this. Oh, my gosh. Archangel Raphael, I can't make it up. The Lover's Card. Yeah. And it's like a lover could have gave this person hell. Like, you know, we need money now. We need the bills paid now. That's a good idea. I know this motherfucking idea can make you money one day. But one day ain't today and tomorrow. We might, you know, they might have a kid together or something with somebody. With the Six of Pentacles. Because, you know, Six of Pentacles is uh, two people in the tradition of Tara. In a court with somebody. Okay. Um, something like that. Yeah. Yup, and the Seven of Pentacles. Yeah, but this person invested. Yup, they did, but they stuck it in there, y'all. This person been through hell. Oh my gosh. And they're 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 looking for happiness. Yup. This part this is somebody here that then came up on it, honey. Came up on it. And they're they're some and they see something in you that's very similar. Yeah, I'm telling you, the Eight of Cups, the two, two of Swords, and the Three of Pentacles. Yup, and the Ten of Wands. Somebody here knows what it looks like. Yup, and that's how they're able to see you clearly. Y'all are very similar. Y'all are so, so amazed. What's the Two of Swords? You don't know, you don't you don't see this, or you don't expect them to see this in you. Yup, the higher front. This is, you don't see this love. And somebody here knows, like, you, like, you know been betrayed i don't know something like them hurt in the past like they see it yep the hangman and it's like they want you and they feel like y'all deserve each other or some shit like that yeah let's see what else is going on here yep i told you marriage page of swords and they watch you online now for this person who does have a child they could still want children too, guys, with marriage and a child card. What else is going on here? Mm. But Archangel Raphael is bringing you guys together. And he is here twice with the lover's card, like I told you guys. And this, this is because both of you guys have healed and learned something. Yep. So y'all deserve, it's like y'all, um... Y'all y'all have both learned something very similar and lessons as well. And it's like y'all are per it's a perfect vibration on frequency together. Yeah. Let's see what else is going on here. Let's see, guys. What else is going on here? Let's see. Okay, the king of wands. I told you. Oh my gosh. Sudden wealth. Child. I can't That's make it up. Said. Yes. And this is somebody here. Um they went through hell, y'all. They went through hell to get this success. They did. They they crossed a lot, had to go on a journey. They had to take a drought, honey. Yup, but they got it, the Queen of Pentacles. And they could have put the 22, um, Ascended Masters 22s here. This is also someone that's, a, a, like, able to, like, chill, lay back. Someone here can also, like, be able to take care of, the, yep, look at this. Six of Pentacles, yep, to the Seven of Pentacles. Here it is, honey. And I told you, somebody here is taking care of, like, um, a mom or a sister or some shit like that. I don't know. So, um, we got bad health. Somebody here feels, um, I told you, like, both of you guys could have healed from something that was bad. Some kind of stress or some shit. This could have caused, like, this transformation could have also, like, child, they've been through hell, man. They could have almost, maybe they would have, they just was stressed out. They wasn't going to make it, man. Some people get depressed and, like, check out. And that doesn't mean, like, you know all the way but just check out in life just be down and out they put their all their listen they put all you see all them sevens they put all their investment all their money all their pennies into something 
and um it is it's gonna work out for them okay but this 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 is like yeah i can't make it up they did it was a big gamble but they stuck with it they did it and it's going to pay off the angelics is definitely working on like uh this person's side they're getting favor yeah look at this love child divide this is the divine masculine that's another reason but they had to learn certain lessons that's what this is what's the true emotions for you Mm, so they want they like reek re, like wreaking the rewards button and be with you mm. and they could still want to like i'm not done like now i want to have a child now i want to experience that i got the money i got the time i want to do it right you know some per parents a lot of us that are parents are go through breakups and stuff you know you we in today's world you need two three jobs and you don't get a chance to, you got to miss certain things and sacrifice things to make it happen. And th this person now is coming into the money where some of it, maybe not all of it is there yet. It's still growing, but they'll be able to have the ability, all right, to do the things they always wanted to do when their other kids was little. They could still want to do that. I just saw this on this card and I never noticed this. I want to show you something. Hold on, child. We're going to get the crystal one. Oh, child. Yeah, look at this, lovers. Now, you, you you see this right here? Hold on, child. I got, the, I, got the, I got to pull this up. Look at that. That says, call me. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, they, they, y'all going to call each other? Or y'all y'all going to exchange numbers? They going to tell you to call them? Oh, my gosh. What's the true emotions here? Divine masculine and divine feminine. Yeah, see, thug. Now, somebody here is a thug. Or they got, somebody here is also like a survivor. Like, they got a little thug in them, honey. They got a little fight in them. They don't go out just like that. It might have took them down a couple times, but they got back up and dust that shit off. Yeah, okay, sex addiction. Now, somebody here also gave a little sex addiction. Or this is somebody here that could use sex as like a tool. Yup. You might need to know that. Okay, and that's important too because when things get tough or they go through certain shit, sex will be like an outlet. Mm. Yeah, child, so you're you going to have to, you know, pump your iron, child. I don't know. Yeah, but you're this person's wish fulfillment. Mm. All right, let's see what this person wants to say to you. I'm choosing myself. I don't think I deserve you. For some of you guys, maybe you, you you don't choose this person, but this is what they want, and this is what they've been through. I don't know. Let's see what's going on. I don't know, y'all. Or maybe we haven't finished our journey yet in the past life and now we're here together again in reverse. Y'all might go through a little something. Yeah, I want to reach out to you down. So y'all going to go through a little something because you're like really stand off. Maybe you don't like um, at first be as accepting to them or some shit. Because you didn't been through, you know, your own shit. And you're just like, you're. this is not expecting. It's like, oh, out of the blue, here you come. But, you know, just like, wait a minute. Like, you might like tell them to pump their brakes or something. You are the soul I've been seeking for. I can't make this shit up. I can't make it up. And something about the Sheikah tribe. You could be, some of you guys could come from that tribe. You know, the Sheikah tribes, um, the tribes inside the earth. Okay, that has a lot to do with, like, the blue and the green skin. Okay, because you would only come up at certain times of the sun that was out to, like, eat, get certain crops, shit like that. You know, when you go back into Village Tribe and you study about that, so that your color of your skin. Okay, a lot of you guys, I've been picking that up once. So I know I got a lot of um, Sheikah, some say Shelka tribes in here. Okay, you also could connect um, to the black sun. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, y'all gonna go through a little something. Maybe this person has to fight 
you know, to get you on the same page or to make you realize they're serious about, you know, what they want in their life, love. But you ain't got time to play right now. You ain't playing with that shit. All right. You just don't got time. What's the love oracle? What's the love oracle messages? Kiss. Yep, they want to kiss you. Oh, child. Yep, look at this. Fall in love. This person is going to fall. They, they're looking for love, and you are you're their love. And also, Archangel Raphael, it's not like you're, it's, it's going to happen. And maybe at first you're like, no, and then he's like, yeah. <laughs> romantic, romantic, like, sexual encounter. Ooh. Hold on. Sit in the in a tree. K I S S I N G. First comes love, then comes marriage, then comes the baby in the baby carriage. Oh my gosh, the nurse. That's what she said. Ooh, child, I can't make it up. Marriage. Child, listen. This is somebody, this is a soulmate. This soulmate was also, y'all were picked for each other. Okay, to be honest with you, whatever the contract said before y'all came down here, it's it's it, y'all are ready to come into some kind of union. They did, they learned what they're supposed to learn. You learned what you were supposed to learn, and that's going to form their frequency of attracting y'all. You're about to attract each other in. The the thing is, they already see you, they already know you, they already had their eye on you, and they have already been getting angelic downloads about you. Child, this is deep right here. Okay, let's get you some oracles, child. Mm. Knowledge, I can't make it up. This new beginning is a new cycle. Um, uh, also, a new opportunity. Others of you guys, this is a soulmate of yours. Coming in for a new beginning. Yeah. Yep. And it's going to be celebrations. Come on, this new beginning is going to bring celebrations. All right. Lord, yeah, angels of miracle, because the angels are working out miracles for you. Um, especially Archangel Raphael. Okay. Some of you guys might be even, like, connecting with him in a dream uh, or download in nature. I don't know if you um, know that. You might have also saw him in a crowd of people. He also could have checked, like, some enemies of yours. And this could even be family enemies. Mm. Child. I don't want that. I, that that ain't good, honey. That ain't good at all. <laughs> okay, when the angelics get to check checking certain shit, it it, it it ain't Okay. Don't don't get it after if the angels are divine. But just but you you also know, like, yeah. That's that that that's giving that Archangel Michael kind of energy as well. All right, what's this? What's the love? What's the oracle's thinking? Spirit. Go with the flow. Yep, I can't make it up. So you're going to be able to go with the flow with somebody. There's an opportunity that's coming in for you. All right, um, that you're going to meet this person. And it's just going to play out. I don't. You're not expecting this. You didn't know this. This is not um, even what you... That's how it always works, though. Love always comes when you just let it flow to you. When you just let it come in. When you just stay focused on your journey. It, it's never when you're looking for it. Um, good fortune. Here it is. Yeah. And it's like good fortune. I also feel like, you know, because certain frequencies and vibrations, especially when you attract another high vibration, you manifest. You might really be helping this person manifest money. Yeah. Don't worry. Be happy. And it's like, now that they met you, all their worries is over. Plus, when you guys are lifting up each other's frequency and vibration, it helps you manifest and attract shit easier. Better. Okay? So they might even be coming up with, like, um, better work ideas, better work ethnic, stronger, happier, more enthusiastic, more enthusiasm, all right? Shit like that. All right, let's get your sense of plan as love. You, this is something you got coming in. Yep, messages, sectarius. This could be a sectarius expand. 
the ninth house. Also give it that Jupiter energy, which is also Sagittarius energy. Yeah. So you could be connected to this person's Jupiter. Your soulmates. Yep. And y'all heal something and an entrance opens up for you guys or something like that. Like a new beginning entrance or some shit. Okay. What's the sounds of planets here? Show me. Oh, shit. I just saw a partnership. And first house arrival. This is a person that is coming in. They're going to arrive out of nowhere. And their partnership happens. You could be seeing a lot of like um, bluebirds. What I tell you. We got communication and invitation. And this is somebody that's going to invite you somewhere. We're going out. I'm coming to get you. I want you to do this. I want you to meet this person. Something like that is here. Solar flare. Yeah. And something happened around a solar flare. Yeah. That could have opened up some kind of entrance for energy. So when the when um y'all elevated, they elevated or something, but y'all both got some kind of elevation. Yup, change Uranus. Oh my gosh. And that changed everything. Wow. Aries energy. So now that's what's coming in for you. Also, um, Uranus also um deals with revelation. Aqua Aries energy. This this was already prophesized. Yeah. Soulmates. Child. The T is you up next, baby, for a relationship. Um, and for some of you guys, this is like can lead to marriage. This could just be um lead to commonwealth. This could be a spiritual marriage. Take it how it resonates with you guys. But uh, you know, a soulmate reuniting is marriage the two of cups is a marriage okay that's what i'm seeing here okay all right okay guys soulmates you better go ahead with your best self i love you all stay dope guys do not forget to hit that like button all right don't forget to hit that bell hit all that keeps you tapped into your messages and you will be notified when they're ready and available for you guys stay dope i'll catch you in your next video upload i'll share they one